Do you know me? Well, the voting's done. And that worked out really well, actually. I was able to throw a little laundry in before I left, and by the time I got back, it was ready to come out. Kinda like voting. Getting rid of the dirty laundry and changing it. Anyway, got that done. One more thing out of the way. So I just wheeled over to vote. It was only about four blocks away. I live in a high density populated area, lots of apartments, nice tree filled streets. So as I indicated earlier, lots of leaves this time of year. And I discovered another uh, little problem these leaves tend to cover up and there tends to be more of it in a high density area. And what is that problem? People and their dogs. Now I have nothing against dogs, I've always generally had a dog in my life. I don't right now, but first time in five years I haven't had a dog. But it was my responsibility to make sure my dog was taken care of, and that included picking up after it when we went for a walk. Problem with me, you might step on it if it's under a leaf. I wheel over it, winds up on my gloves, and I may not notice it till I go to scratch my nose or something. Anyway, if you ever meet me, never shake my hand when I have my gloves on because God knows what's going on. But I have to wear a lot of gloves because of that. You never know what's going to be on the street. People ask me if I'm reading when I do a lot of these little videos because they say I'm always looking down. I guess I'm used to looking down. I'm always looking down at the street to see what crack is where, what piece of dog crap is where, what twig is where, what rock is where. You just sort of pay attention to it because it can bring a wheelchair to a sudden stop if you don't. And I do it almost unconsciously. So I'm not reading script here. I'm generally like say, looking down at the ground, so bear with me. And please, make sure you clean up after your dogs. Anyway, that's my little rant for now. Ciao, have a good day. Bye-bye. Oh, that Terry. He breaks me up at times. Yeah, his name is really Terry. Now, come on. Who would really name their kid Rolly Spokes? Give it a rest. Bye-bye.